Welcome back to my Jack 3 Let's Play once more. And I am, and I am recording from my relative's house. So uh, w once again here, the storyline of this continues on. With the catacombs and the palace ruins taken care of, the, t the, the tunnel way here will lead straight to the planetary defense system. The last precursor tunnel. Planetary defense system has been reached. <laughs> Apologies with the barking in the background, it, it, it gets on your nerves. I'm still taking care of the pet. We're a bunch of little fuzzy rats. Would you worship us? Could we run the universe? Not possible, buddy. So we fluff up the myth a bit. And we get the respect we deserve. You idiots! Get down from there and stop defiling that glorious machine! Do not let our size fool you. We are the most powerful beings in the universe. We are? <laughs> Why does Daxter look like? Ah, yes. All ego contains the source of our essence, our code, so to speak. When Daxter touched the dark ego, he was actually blessed when he thought he was cursed. Woohoo! I'm a precursor! I'm a precursor! I'm a precursor! Hey! Wait a minute! They have pants! These creatures are the great precursors! And I wanted to evolve into them. No! <laughs> Little breath, isn't it? The only way to ensure that Errol will not awaken 
the ship's cargo is to go there yourself and stop him. We will send you there from here. But the weapon? Chill out, buddy. You should have Mondo minutes to go there and get back here pronto. I'm way before the... Hopefully before. Ba-boom! Oh, yeah! Let's move. You idiots. I told you we needed a plan B. Time to stop Arrow and the dark ship. I'll help you carry it up. Yeah. Oh, by the way, everyone, uh, don't really pay attention to any voices in the background. There's just a few people that are here with me. Well, that takes care of the first half of the Dark Ship mission here, and it'll continue in the, the next part I do.